Meet Belle, our new German Shepherd puppy. Meet Cinder, the older seven and a half year old chocolate lab. Join us as we bring these two together, train them, learn from them, and become a family. Oh yeah, and look out for cuteness. This video is made possible by Ranger Rob Poopy Bags, available on Amazon right now. Okay guys, in today's video you get to see uh, Belle's new uh, kennel. This is where she eats. We have to keep them separated from the big dog, otherwise they eat, eat each other's food. Um, Belle's been having trouble with having good bowel movements, so we're actually starting to give her a raw food di diet uh, based off chicken and some uh, pumpkin and uh, so, uh, yogurt with no seasoning in it or, or sugar and uh, trying to firm up things for her a little bit. And you can see we have to keep them separated ways. Uh, of course, Belle gets her food done much faster. And this is uh, uh, Cinder's time to get her wet food. So, uh, yeah, we're kind of working on diets. But today we also are going to be working on swimming again uh, because uh, she did fall in the pool the other day. And, uh, you know, we were there. But still, one of these days she could fall in the pool and we wanted her to know how to get out. So, yeah, busy day. So let's get started. As soon as Cinder's done eating her food, uh, this is when we let uh, Belle out. And of course, Belle's gonna go immediately over to Cinder's dish and find out if there's anything left over. <laughs> anyway, so you can see why we gotta keep them separated. And the older dog is still pretty patient with a small dog, but still, when it comes to food, she might just slop her around. I wouldn't blame her. So let's get moving. So this is the next day and um, the puppy doesn't seem to be quite moving yet, but someone's waiting for her to play. So yeah, we got a good day coming. Come on, Belle, get up. There's no lack of enthusiasm from the chocolate lab today. Pretty sure the puppy stayed up too late watching cartoons or something. I got you, dog. And back to Cinder. She still has enthusiasm. Let me have the ball. Come here. Come back here. Really? All right. We've got the ball. We've got the gun. We gotta try to do all this one handed again. <laughs> Take the ball. Alright, so. Are you ready? Are you set? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I think that's going to require a wet dog. Oh, I think she's going to get it. And she gets it. Yay! Good job. Meanwhile, over here, Meet my breakfast. I'm not pointing at you. I'm pointing at the puppy playing in the dirt. Finally, Cinder gets her to start playing and get motivated. And once you do that, there's no shutting this little puppy off. Okay, so it's time to uh, start getting ready for another puppy swimming lesson. So what Sherry does is get the balls run in and get Cinder swimming in the pool and trying to tell the puppy that uh, the water is fun. Uh, however, she tolerates the water, doesn't get upset, but she doesn't seem very enthused about it either. So we'll see how it goes today.
It appears that someone's avoiding their swimming lesson. Apparently this dog is not real thrilled about getting wet. This dog is totally not impressed with water yet. Not scared of it, just not impressed. And this dog still isn't impressed. We could put 25 balls out there and she wouldn't be impressed. But Cinder's trying. Now remember guys, we're teaching her to be able to swim, figure out how, where to get out in the pool and get out by herself. So she uh, has to struggle a little bit, but she does get herself out. You did it! Alrighty, well one more try for the puppy. Not interested in the ball. Not really too thrilled at all. Not upset and not panicking. Just not impressed so we let her swim to the edge again and let her lift herself out so it's still a good exercise when she gets older she will fall in love with the pool hey Belle. I think someone might be mad at us. I think we decided that she's just a little diva and doesn't like to have her hair messed up. Uh, so really, I think she's just pouting because of that. But Cinder's not going to pass up on this opportunity. It's a beautiful day and it's time to go swimming again. Meanwhile, the diva just gets her tan. So believe it or not, people, I believe this dog is actually cold. So uh, you'll see in a minute here, we had to put her, we put her in the house in her uh, kennel and uh, she was shivering. So here's what we did. Yeah, so we wrapped her up in a towel and she was very happy about that. I find it amazing that the fur on a uh, German Shepherd and a Labrador is so different. I think she really was a little cold. Thank you very much for watching our video. Please take the time to like, subscribe, and share our videos all over the whole wide world. 
Thanks. <laughs>